But uh, the argument of this paper is that we have not uh, maximized or optimized the allied role in, in uh, regional strategy. There has been a long-standing uh, argument among many that allies don't want to choose between the United States and China in a new Cold War. That's true. This is not a new Cold War. It is far more complicated than a new Cold War. Strategic competitions take all kinds of manifestations. In this, in, in this particular competition, uh, trade and interdependence will coexist very uneasily with uh, military and security competition. But the Allies have made a choice. The Allies have chosen exactly as we have, which is to engage China and try to benefit from China's economic boom. But they've also started to build and acquire military power of their own. Now, our job, in my view, is to start to knit this together into something more cohesive. Right now, what is called for in, in Asia is more clarity. More clarity in terms of our interests, more clarity in terms of alliances. The ambiguities, I think, are causing more instability. For a long time, we had the so-called hub and spoke model, where we were the hub and the allies were the spokes, and it was really more of a protectorate model. I think it's time to move to something a little bit more cohesive than that. The good news is allies are buying uh, equipment, uh, much of it made in the United States, which can easily make it interoperable through the right training uh, and other activities uh, with the United States. Uh, but again, uh, th there's, there's still a, I think, apprehension about working more closely together. Uh, Japan and South Korea uh, have have their problems that I think can be resolved, but I think the United States can take a role in resolving them. Uh, and uh, India is a big um, challenge for the United States. If we get that right, I think it'll be a prize in terms of integrating it into uh, East Asia and, and playing a role in uh, policing the sea lanes around the Malacca Strait. Uh, and I think the United States can, can play a very big role in knitting all of the allied capabilities together with uh, a coalition-based uh, uh, C4ISR, uh, basically uh, intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance capability, so that all allies, even if they don't sit together in a, uh, in a headquarters, can at least see the same picture of uh, destabilizing uh, military activity from China uh, or from other countries, uh, f for that matter. Uh, finally, uh, just two points. One is the worst thing we can do right now, and this I think is is um, uh, starting to gain some purchase in, in elite opinion, uh, is to start to pull offshore and say that al allies have to do more uh, while we pull offshore and go back to Guam. Um, uh, you know, we tried a Guam-Hawaii strategy in 1940. Um, didn't work out very well. 